Hey, 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 Virgo. How you going? <laughs> this is your love reading for the second half of April 2020. So if you haven't been here before, I welcome you to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me. We're going to do a quickie. Um, and uh, this is going to be about who's coming towards you in love or who you're thinking of at this time. Okay, so we're going to get what they're thinking, feeling and doing. Um, or instead of doing, you know, the action space. So if you haven't been here before, like I say, I welcome you. If you are coming back again, thank you for, thank you for being here. And um, I also wanted to say that if you want a private reading from me, my details are in the description box below. Uh, they do book up fast so you know if you need one you know the sooner the better if you can get in touch with me would be good um, because yeah there's been a bit of demand lately I do twin flame readings I do soulmate readings uh, general readings you know rega related to um, you know love work or employment or um, you know just general uh, whatever you know whatever you need and you can ask me questions um, about what you need to know so let's see who this person is that's coming towards you. Um, they've been a little bit stressed. Whoever it is that you're thinking about has had some stress. They've kind of been through it a bit. Perhaps you've been through it a bit. Um, okay. There's this need and want for happiness right now within your energy and within theirs. There's this need for wanting to work hard but you know kind of being exhausted kind of being at the end of your tether we have the two of pentacles here um in reverse and so you know this tells me that you've been juggling for a while you've been you have been not your not your um significant other who we're talking about here or whoever's coming towards you but it looks like you've been kind of juggling everything you know like money's been coming in and out um, you know, there's been a few hard times. You feel, you know, you feel like you're juggling a little bit too much, but the cards are here saying that that's going to change. So that's just a side note, regardless of, you know, who's coming towards you right now. You know, hang in there. Things are going to start improving for you, Virgo. So let's see what this person is thinking wow we have four of wands here and so i'm dropping cards all over the place at the moment but the four of wands here denotes that this person is perhaps your twin flame okay if you don't know what a twin flame is uh you can you know go to my twin flame videos and uh, learn a little bit more about that um, or you can contact me um below or you can look up the history of twin flames. Plato speaks of this. Um, but this person believes they are your twin flame. Okay, a twin flame is different from a soulmate. The twin flame is, is you know, your soul split into two. You've got half of the soul. They've got the other half, you know, in two different bodies. So this is someone who believes they are your twin flame. Whether they are or not is not, is not known. But this is what they're thinking. They think they're your twin flame. They believe that there's going to be a new beginning with you. They want a new beginning with you. They perhaps may need to move overseas to see you or journey to you. I don't feel that you are close. They have been thinking about this a lot in their mind. They have been manifesting it. They have been visualizing it. They have been imagining, you know, that um, you are going to be the one. Okay. So this is what they're thinking. This is in their mind. So what they're feeling is that they've had this need to go within to work out what would give them happiness, what would give them pleasure. They may have been talking to a lot of different people. And come to realize that you are special. You're different than the others. You make them feel like a fool for love. 
they feel as though you make them believe in themselves. They feel as though you take a sense of burden off of their shoulders. They feel as though they can move into the right direction with you. They feel accomplished with you. They feel a sense of accomplishment with you. All right, so this is really beautiful. What are they doing about it? Okay, I can see that either in summer or you could have met this person in summer or they could be coming towards you in summer. Okay, they think the absolute world of you. They also believe that you are not seeing the potential here. That you are walking on a bit of a tightrope. You know, you don't know which way to go. Um, they feel as if you've got your eyes closed. And so they're trying to tell you that, you know, this is something that needs to happen. Um, they've been working on their health. They've been working on their spiritual transformation. Um, if they're not spiritual, they've been... I don't know, they've been exercising or they've been doing something with their diet. They've been doing something, you know, to try and maybe impress you even, you know, like, um, I don't know, lifting weights or doing aerobics or yoga or meditation or something. You know, they've been really working on themselves to try and attract you in. Okay, so, you know, this person loves you with all of their heart. This person truly believes that you two have an understanding together and that you belong together this is twin flames this is this is you know how they feel they feel as though you're their flame they feel as though you know you will give them literally the other half of their soul <laughs> they've really got it bad for you like you know i'm talking you know, this is can be a little bit of an obsession here. Um, although they are working on themselves, which means <clears throat> if they're working on themselves, they could understand the twin flame journey well, because the twin flame journey is a journey to the self. And once you come into a wholeness of yourself, you can meet with your twin flame. So I think they have a bit of spiritual knowledge here. They seem to know a little bit how to manifest what they're doing. Of course, it's totally up to you whether or not you move forward with this person. Please don't doubt my love for you. It's the only thing I'm sure of is what they're saying to you, Virgo. Wow. Okay. All right. So I'm sorry that this is, this is how things turned out. This is with relation to what's going on in the world right now. <laughs> okay. I'm a big mess and that's the last thing you need right now. So even though they want to move towards you, they still don't think they're good enough. And then in the next breath, <laughs> this is funny. Uh, I mean, it's not funny. It's just crazy because they're saying I'm, the, I'm a big mess and that's the last thing you need right now. But then in the next breath, they're saying I need you because I love you. So there's a little bit of this codependency here. You know, they want, they want to be with you because they feel like they need you, you know, like... Um, you know what I mean? Codependency here. And then, you know, this is confirmation on how they feel too. When I look into your eyes, I know I have found the mirror of my own soul. So, you know, they hands down believe for sure that they are your twin. Whether or not you believe in twin flames or not is, is another thing. Uh, you might want to look this up. And if you need any clarity with regard to who this person is, you know, I, I do do personal readings, um, but I get booked up quite quickly. So if you need me, reach out to me at my email. It's in the description box below. Uh, and then I can look into your personal situation and you can ask me questions as well. Okay. <laughs> wow, Virgo. Twin flame stuff, hey? Just because they think they're your twin flame, though, it doesn't necessarily mean that they are your twin flame. They think they are though, they really do. Uh, but they're kind of exhausted, kind of been through it a little bit lately. 
maybe because of the world situation, maybe because they've had a little bit of stress going on around them in their private life. Okay, thank you for joining me, Virgo. Um, I'll be doing the next, you know, half monthly reading in May. And if you want to uh, look at my Twin Flame videos or Ascension videos, you know, I welcome you to my channel. Okay, love and light to you. Bye.